Yo, what's going on, people? So, we still got a trailer this week. I thought we weren't, but uh, they just changed the timing. You know, it's just two days later instead of uh, Tuesday, so we're still in there. It's Paul this time, so let's go ahead and get it rolling and um, start the um, analyzation. Yeah, I'm super late, but uh, better late than never. Never get tired of that screen. All right, so... Let's see here. Paul Phoenix. Get ready for the next battle. Section 8. New Challenger. Oh, goodness, the smile. Phoenix. Yeah, the mouse. Yes. Oh, wow. Oh, new stage. Reminds me of tag one. What? I'll show you. Strongest in the universe. Feel strongest in the universe. What? <laughs> Did his sleeve just blow off? That's new. Okay. That's that's very interesting. That is very interesting. So, as usual, we're gonna have to watch this again in um slow mo and um see what the heck is going on. But first, um, we gotta hear this voice again. We gotta hear this voice. That that announcer is just incredible. You guys hear that? Phoenix. Hey. Yeah, I am glad they remember that he likes bikes. He likes motorcycles. Yeah, we, we haven't seen like a, a bike with Paul in forever. Yeah, I didn't play the story mode in Tekken 7. I didn't play the, um, you know, the character arcade modes. But, yo, look at him. He's got a new face. He, he looks older. But the hairstyle, I don't exactly like it. But anyways, let's let's go ahead and look at the um, this move here. So what does he do? What does he do? A jumping right punch that's plus on block. Law tries to launch and... It looks like Magic 4. Yeah, so Magic 4 doesn't combo. It's not a full juggle, but you do get a free death fist. And he slides. So is this like a floating state, possibly? Or is it just new? Okay, so while standing forward with a new animation. Wow. Law tried to step here. I don't know. I don't know that. Let me look again. Let me look again. This death fist. I'm, I'm gonna have to put. I'm gonna have to put this on a uh, regular, regular speed because it looked like he. Um... Oh, so he can charge up his death fist now. Okay, so that there looks like a, a new string, obviously. Yeah. So while standing two again, we saw this in the uh, the the long breakdown video. It launches like a regular launch now, so that's a big buff for Paul. 
Kata. Just frame demo man. Oh, he has a jumping homing kick. I didn't notice that he jumped. And he just does it. He had... Okay, back one plus two. Wow. While standing. Was that while standing one? Let me look one more time. It looks like a while standing one. Yeah, while standing one, two. Oh, he did a cross. He did a cancel of some sort after this. You see that? Oh, he did the sway back. So that's sway back. Probably one plus two, maybe. Interesting. With the flip over, okay. <laughs> this smile. Yo. They really, yo, this is Paul Phoenix, guys. This is Paul Phoenix with his hair, his new face, and this crazy grin. Yo. <laughs> Yo, what do you guys think about this new look for Paul? I think it's... I guess it's okay. The hair is still... I will never say that this hair is cool. Not for Paul. But I'm glad he has a, you know, a new look. He looks old like he's supposed to. Okay. So he does heat burst here. It's the hammer of the gods. Puts him in bound. So we got... 3 2 into this same ender he just did for a tailspin. Finishes it with 4 4 2 1. Alright, so this is a heat engager, the Death Fist. Hashes out with a uh, heat smash. Yeah, we saw this in the, uh, the the big breakdown, so that's that's nothing new. Gets rid of heat. Okay, so he blocks while standing two. Does this, whatever this is, it's like a catch throw into a heat engage, maybe? That's new, I've never seen anything like that before for Tekken 8. So this this is um actually cool. Knees him right to the face, my goodness. And he's in heat. So now back two into one. Guard breaks. Oh wow. Iron Mountain through the balcony. Still, still bounces like Tekken 7 and he does a big, it looks like down back two. So he has a new string here with a, I guess, four two or something. Oh wow. So that was the new string again while wow, standing one, two into a sway. He was already in heat, so let's let's look again. Yeah, he was already in heat when he did this. Yeah. While wow, standing one, two, way back two. And that is a you know, heat dash cancelable. And then this big new combo extender. My goodness, the combos in this game are going to be crazy. What was that move? Yeah, this move here. Big elbow into, he catches him and does a suplex. Paul has a suplex now? Yo, I just can't wait to see whatever King does. But anyway, it's okay. So this is quarter circle back four. And he goes into the rage art. Does the neck popping. You see he has his sleeve, right? With all the ropes on it. But it's just one rope. Strongest in the universe. So this is new. This man sheds his sleeve. Boom. <laughs> That is cool. That is the coolest thing about Paul so far. This is really cool. That's like an anime. That is, yo, I've seen so many anime characters do that before where they just flex and then their clothes just shred off. That it may, it immediately makes me think of um, um, Kenshiro 
from uh, Fist of the North Star. He just flex and everything comes off. But with Paul here, it's just the, you know, the Death Fist arm. <laughs> yeah, immediately had me thinking about that. Fist of the North Star. You know, he just, ah! Right before the da 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 But yeah, that is, that is really cool. So, um, yeah, Paul... I guess we could take from this, he gets two new moves that uh, look really good. Aside from all the other new animations and new moves that he did in this trailer. That suplex is definitely um, definitely my favorite. Let me go back to it. Yeah, that the suplex was really great. Yeah, I was like around here somewhere. Yeah, an elbow and they fly up and he catches you. That is so cool. This this is almost like a DOA catch or something, because DOA characters have um, air like catch throws like that, where it's an attack and it just hits into a grab. So this is something that um, not even King has this. Armor King doesn't have this either. I don't think any um, who has this An actual attack that turns into a grab midair. Maybe my memory is not serving me well right now, but this. This is cool stuff though. Yeah, this is really cool. Like an aerial catch throw? Who has that? I'm trying to think, who who does? I, I can't think of anyone right now, but let me know in the comments. Who else has something like this? Um, Kunimitsu, Kunimitsu, she has it. I think Yoshi might have it too with his um, his fly stance, um, 3 plus 4. I think that does catch you in the air too, but... Wow, Paul even has it now, and King still doesn't. That is so dope. This this is the dopest move he's done in the entire trailer. I love this. A German suplex? I know it's not a, a complete German, but it's it's definitely a suplex of some sort. So, um, yeah, I'm, I'm hyped for Paul. I might have to learn Paul again. I know all the Paul mains are very happy for, like... You know everything except for the hair but if you actually like this new hairstyle then this is a like 10 out of 10 trailer for you so uh, yeah excited to see who's next which you know it's, it's probably most certainly gonna be this guy that gets a trailer next but again as always let me know what you guys think in the comment section how is Paul in Tekken 8 what do you guys think of the trailer I think it was it was a W. It was a W trailer. Cause at first I was like, uh, you know, they showed us 36 minutes of Paul. <laughs> and that that breakdown for the heat system, they did everything with Paul. So there there wasn't a lot of new things in this trailer. But at the same time, it, it was enough, you know. The new jumping kicks, the new um grab there, and the little catch throw he did to Law was uh pretty cool yeah i think it was uh around here somewhere or he just yeah he swung at him this looks like a good punish attack yeah you see it's a straight punish yeah that stuff like that is yo i like to see that as a king and armor king enjoyer you know that is um that's cool stuff so that means we, we have a lot to anticipate for King. Yo, he should have throws all over the place from attacks. Like forward three, back three, back turn three. Oh no, we need to have about 10 at least. But anyways, let me know what you guys think. Hit the like button if you haven't and subscribe. You know, I'm going to be covering every single trailer for Tekken 8 as they come. Hopefully it's um, still going to be on a weekly basis. We just don't know which day um yeah but let me know and i'll see you guys next time peace